So hey, welcome back there. Tonight we're coming out on a blustery old evening. We're gonna come out and test some uh, new birds and what we've got. We managed to pick up some birds to give you a show we get that from our uh, made by Shimano. I haven't really seen the Shimano, well, not many Shimano lures, but these ones, uh, yeah, they look really uh, good. So I've been, uh, yeah, uh, gone and bought a couple, and test them out, see if they have some bats tonight. So, uh, yeah, nice to see you uh, there. This is the one I've got on the moment, I'll show you what we get down there. The one I've got on is a similar uh, pattern to one of the IV lures. And for, uh, yeah, a couple of cards in here. So yeah, we'll put it to the test, see if they're cheap for those work. So, heading down to the mark now, I said it's pretty blustery. But uh, yeah, we're gonna give it a go and see what happens. So we'll see you down there. So it's gonna give you a quick run through of the lures we're gonna be using. I'll say they're uh, new to me, that's for sure. We got the um, Shimano Worldwide Minnow. This is 115 uh, millimeters. As you see there, it's 17 gram. Looks really good. It's got the little um, spinner in the middle there. So uh, yeah, hopefully it's gonna do the business. But to start off with, we're just going to be starting off with this little pop here. This looks the bee's knees. This is Silent Assassin. Again, uh, Shimano lure. It does look the bees. Like I said, it's a similar pattern to a um, IMA lure. Again, uh, and this is 17 gram again. But uh, yeah, it doesn't go very, about 15 centimeters it uh, goes down to. Quite a heavy lure. I love the pattern on there. So yeah, we're going to put these to the test and hopefully we can hook up to some bass tonight. But yeah, for the price, I uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to trying them. Absolutely beautiful. So now I've shown you the uh, lures we're going to be testing tonight. Let's get down to the water's edge and let's see how they cast and how they perform. I say when I seen them in the shop, I couldn't resist to pick them up. So uh, yeah, hopefully we can put them into action and show you some bass of it tonight. So I'm coming to a rock mark tonight. We've got a head on wind. So yeah, I don't know how well they're gonna cast. The wind was supposed to drop off, but it hasn't. It's still probably about a force four, maybe touching a force five. So uh, yeah, we'll have to do what we can and see how it plays out really. But uh, yeah, it's nice to be out again. Chasing some bass. I still wanna do some day fishing, but it's having the time at the moment. So yeah, at the moment the night fishing's uh, taken over a little bit. But yeah, as long as we catch fish, we don't mind. And hopefully you guys enjoy the content as well. I pump out for you. And if you do, like I say, if you hit the like button. If you want to see bass fishing in the future, feel free to subscribe. Make sure the notification bell is turned on and you won't miss a video. So yeah, it's enough rabbiting from me. Let's test this lure out. Right, let's get our first cast in the water. So I was using that silent assassin lure to start off with. See if it can do the job for us. Oh, it's still quite low. Got uh, 8.2 high tonight. It's currently half tied up. The tide's got a lot to do to come up. But yeah, this lure on Carson passed pretty well, to be honest. Got to hope there's some basils in here. So that tide's shallow. Again, you've got the tide pushing this lure. That's the only problem we're going to have. It's got snagged there a little bit. Got it back. <laughs> that would have been a great start. First cast and we'd have lost the lure. We don't want to do that, that's for sure. But yeah, first instinct, the uh, casting's really good on it. Say it's only 17 gram. I'm pretty impressed, to be honest. So we've got the other lure to try as well. This one uh, doesn't produce the bass. And if we can't find anything on these lures, we'll try a soft plastic or something. But I wanted to test these out really more than anything. But it all plays into the uh, hands of the wind and that. What the wind's gonna do. But I say before I came out to make this video, I was not expecting it to be this windy. That's for sure. <whistles> oh, 
bloody wind's bitter cold. So that's had my first inquiry there. Just had a few nips on the back of the lure. It feels like I'm plucking only small fish. That's for sure, it wasn't anything big. But definitely something had a guy. And I go, I feel it bang, bang, bang on the back of the lure. Small bass, I reckon. I said we're fishing a big boulder bed here. The bass normally love this kind of terrain. Ambush their prey very easily. I have a free feed. Nice swell in the water as well, helps, that's for sure. So yeah, hopefully we can hook up before long. But yeah, I'm really impressed with this lure. Just got to get a bass on it now. Use my Savage Gear SGS4 rod tonight, 8.44 gram. Could have done with my pen... Um, Rod tonight's a bit stiffer, but yeah. But we're we'll persevering with what we've got. So we hook up to that big basil. Right, new location now. I come over to the other side of the bay. My good success here in this uh, the past. Still got the Shimano lower on. Ties perfect for this area. God, I hope there's a bass in here. Moon's starting to come through. Going fishing off the side of a, a boulder bed here, onto some sand. And yeah, over the back of some boulders. Again, perfect habitat for the bass. Hope there's a couple in here. That's the thing with bass fishing. There's, you'll uh, find there's nothing, and all of a sudden the uh, bass will come on the feed. And uh, yeah, you might hook up uh, a good few fish all at once. Apologise for any wind noise as well. If you can hear any on the uh, camera. It's quite blustery. So we're doing with the retrieve, with the Shimano there. Not too quick on the rear, as you can see there. I'm not spinning too fast, just for the odd twitch. And that's literally as simple as it is. What beautiful conditions it really is. Trying to hunt those bass down, that's the thing. <coughs> but perseverance will pay off eventually. Must guarantee it. Cast right across the beach this time. Come on, Basils, where are you hiding now? You're in here somewhere, I know. Dee -dee -dee. Yes, we're in. Woo! We put the lure to the test. We put the blue, um, the uh, silent assassin on. And yeah, we're into a bass. Happy days, fighting well. Got the drag set nicely, so if he does uh, run, he can make a run. Oh, number of times I've uh, made that mistake. I'm not having the drag set, the bass has ran. I'll have, uh, yeah, lost them. But nice and easily, no rush. That's easy to say. Oh, it feels like a not bad fish shot, I think. Unless he's in that bit of swell. He's got a bit of weed around him. But yeah, I'm happy nonetheless anyway. We're back on the bass for the year. Oh, he's going well. Only a poppy, I think, but... All right, it's got to be careful. I'm literally on some very deadly um, seaweed on the rocks. Oh, where are we going to hoist him up? Uh, four. Oh, slippery city. Right, gotta be careful with the way. Sorry about this, guys, but I don't want to uh, 
Yeah, I got soap. Oh. Right. Let's get off here out the way. I'm going to try and bring him up this next way. This is a nice bass. That's a clonking bass. Look at that. Check that out. That's four pound all day. All day long. Right, let's get some safe ground with him. Whoa, just pop him in this pool for a second. Right, let's get some safe ground because it is deadly here, guys. I'll get back to you when I've got him off the hook and we'll get you a show of this cracking bass. Now, check that out for a chunk of a bass, guys. We're going to get a um, measure of it in a second. That's all a five pound all day long. Check out that. That's an absolute beast. Big, chunky bass. Taking on that Shimano uh, Assassin's Minnow. And I think the test is uh, done. Lovely bass. Nailed on that lure. Happy days. Right. So leave it in this pond, get the hook out of it, get a couple of snaps of it. And yeah, I'm absolutely stoked with that. Absolutely beautiful. So there we are. Check that out for a bass. That's all a four and a half, five pound. Check how chunky that fish is. Big old mouth on it. Found that Shimano lure. What an absolute warrior. So yes, get it released. What a beauty. I'm well happy with that second bass of the year. What a chunk. Just gonna go back. As you can't beat the bass. That's what we absolutely love fishing for the bass over here in Guernsey. You can't beat it when you get fish like that. He absolutely crunched that lure. Let's get it back. Right, time to get it released. Cheers, buddy. What a fish. Absolutely. Been reviving the pool nicely. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. It's going to a couple of minutes. Give me one hell of a scrap. But yeah, check that out. Stunning bass. There he is. He's ready to go, giving me the kick. Thank you so much for the fight. And we'll see you when you're £10. Oh, well, cheers, buddy. Awesome. Check that blue out on that fish. In total, oh, that is absolutely beautiful. Off he goes. Now that's the lure that did the damage. That's Shimano. Silent Assassin, and it shows that. Oh, good faith in this lure. Absolutely awesome. We're definitely picking up more of these now. Absolutely beautiful. Check out the pattern on that. He absolutely munched it. Let's go back out there, see if we can get another one. I don't care if we don't get another one, I'm buzzing. Well, that is sure half made my evening. Mission accomplished. The Shimano lure catches bass. Have a few more flicks. And see that fish, he didn't feel uh, as big as the four and a half, five pound when I first hooked into him. But yeah, have a few more chops here. See if we can hook up one more. I'm shaking, I'm so happy with that. Second bass of the year. And it's an absolute beauty. So have a few more chops. So I'm not fussed by catching up one tonight. So happy with that, really am. This mark produces fish like I said earlier. You gotta be here at the right state of tide and you will hook up. Woo, I can't get over, I'm wild chop. I really am. That's what makes bass fishing all worthwhile coming out when it's freezing cold like it is tonight. And you hook up to a sk uh, stunker like that. Absolutely beautiful. If there's one in here, I'd expect there's maybe two more. He might have been alone one on his own. Oh yeah, absolutely beautiful, really is. If you only hit the like button already guys, if you could, that'd be awesome. 
it took a while to get that first fish but it's well worth the watch hopefully nailing something like that Oh, big wave. Woo! <laughs> that came out of nowhere. Alright, that's going to do me for the evening. Pop that back on there. Lovely job. What a trip that was in the end. Absolutely phenomenal bass. Stoked, chuffed a bit. See the smile on my face, I'm well happy with that. I was almost thinking it wasn't going to happen tonight, we weren't going to catch. But yeah, the Shimano lure came from Trumps. So like I said, the test is complete. We now have that bass. So yeah, if you want to see more videos like this, please uh, hit the like button. And if you're new around here, you want to see more videos like this, subscribe. So there's going to be plenty more to come on the channel. So uh, yeah, and leave a comment if you want to know anything. Really appreciate it. But uh, yeah, cheers for all the support. And uh, yeah, hopefully it's going to be a big year for the channel. We're going to see a lot of new faces on the channel as well. We're going to be, uh, yeah, doing a lot of bass fishing. Uh, and other different varieties of fishing. We do a bit more bait fishing hopefully this year and on the boat. So with the time we've got. So yeah, big thanks everyone. Cheers for watching and we'll see you on the next one soon. Have a good week.